Uh, this is supposed to be serious, and so I will try to be serious, which is impossible for me. So what I'd like to do is to introduce you to a very special person. Um, this person is a statesman, a true gentleman, so that counts out for half of it, a veteran, uh, a, ph a philanthropist, and most importantly, an engaged citizen. There are a few words to describe the recipient of this year's highest honor given by the, the Greater Chamber of Commerce. Our honoree has left a lasting impression on institutions both locally and regionally that are almost too many to mention. Although not a native of New Hampshire, the positive impact of his contributions to the state will certainly be felt from generations to come. He is a 1958 graduate of Yale University, a citizen made New Hampshire his home in 1978, and no doubt his passion for the outdoors has influenced his decision to be to live in our great state. Of his many volunteer commitments, he has chaired the New Hampshire chapter of the Nature's Conservatory, the Society of Protection of New Hampshire Forests, and the Northern New Forest Center. He has served on the board of the Appalachian Mountain Club and was instrumental in the creation of the Conversation Conservation Law Foundation. Our citizen has generously applied his professional talents in many philanthropic manner, to, which benefited many organizations. Truly a renaissance philanth philanthropist. Our citizen served on the, on the Board of Trustees of Milton Academy for 17 years and including five as the chair, and he founded, he was one of the founders of Concord's Cherish uh, entities, the Red River Theater. Our honoree served with modesty and humility in public office, both as state senator and as town moderator in his adopted hometown of Webster. As senator, he was highly respected by his peers for serving effectively with his characteristic, characteristic gentle manner and considerable sense of humor, my kind of guy, and the capacity he worked diligently to preserve the quality of life. So it is with great pleasure that the Greater Concord Chamber of Commerce is pleased to award its highest honor to Harold Janeway, our, our 2015 Citizen of the Year. <laughs> Senator Janeway is clearly a person of distinction and it's a tremendous honor and pleasure that I have this, this um, responsibility. So, um, congratulations, and I'll give you... Thank you. I, I am stunned. <laughs> About halfway through, I began to think, uh-oh. <laughs> <laughs> when you got to the Yale of Class 58, and I told that's it. <laughs> first ran for the Senate, I was described as a philanthropist from Webster by the Concord Monitor. And I told the reporter if he referred to me that again, I would never talk to him. And people said, that's okay, people don't know what that means. It could be philanderer. It could be something else that priests get involved in. Um, and I'm glad that actually Webster is part of this wonderful community. Um, I just can't thank you enough, and um, I'll keep doing what I can. Thanks.